Hey everybody, Miss Mini Lover here, and today I'm going to show you how to make stuffing like this on a turkey. I'm not going to show you the turkey, but I'm just going to show you how to do the stuffing part. Um, the only reason is because my sister actually made this turkey, and I'm not sure if I could replicate it, but maybe I'll have her do a tutorial on how to do it. Um, this is very simple. All you need is a piece of sponge, some uh, why can't I think about it? Triple thick. And a toothpick or something to mix on. And some pastels. Some pastel chalks. Now what you're going to want to do is cut a fairly thin piece of sponge. You don't need very much for this. And you're going to want to put it into strips, cut it into strips, and do it as small as you can. So about the size of like cubed bread, because that's how you make stuffing. And then you're going to want to take the strips and cut little squares. Okay, and as you can see, I have fairly small pieces of cubed sponge. Whoops. I just figured out how to use my tripod thing. You can actually lock it so that it bends down, but I have to get the legs right. So that doesn't fall. Yeah, a little more. Okay. So you're going to need some brown pastel chalk. Some yellowish or brownish yellowish chalk and a dark green chalk. Now it doesn't really matter how much of this you put on there. Just scrape some on there. Don't be too stingy about it. You know, a good couple scrapes for each. You're going to want a little more brown than the other chalks. I'm going to put a lot of this yellow this brownish yellow on there. And some brown. Okay. And once you do that, just sort of mix the pastels together just a little bit. Kind of get the... Get them kind of mixed in. Okay. I'm going to put my chalk back. And the next thing you're going to want to do is take your triple thick and put some on the sponge and pastel chalk mixture. And you're going to want to be quick with this. I'm actually going to go ahead and just pour a little bit on there and then go ahead and mix it. Now you're going to want to cover as much of the yellow sponge as you can, but leave some of them kind of just a little bit showing because in stuffing it, um, some of the pieces show up as a slight yellow color and just really get that mixed in there really mash it in there it doesn't have to be liquidy you really don't want it liquidy just sort of mash the color in there get, make sure you get all that TLS throughout the whole mixture, or not TLS but your triple thick through the whole mixture, get it really wet so everything has glaze on it. And make sure you have a bowl ready for this. It looks like stuffing but it sure doesn't smell like it. And it's ready so get your little bowl and just place it in there and this doesn't need to be baked. Make sure it's really in there. Get all the spots covered in there. So it looks like a bowl of flying stuffing. <laughs> and that's your little bowl of stuffing. 
So I guys hope I hope you guys like this tutorial. I know I've been doing a lot of um, holiday tutorials, but again, I'm going to be very busy with graduate school soon, so I won't have any time to um, really get decorations made for Christmas and stuff. So as you can see, I've been working on my Christmas stuff. A little ornament box. I even have I don't know if this is really holiday but little deck of card house I've even made some mints so I've been working pretty hard trying to get stuff done um, I know you guys have there's a lot of tutorials that you guys want me to do I'm still trying to figure out how to do some of them I won't do them in order of when they're requested I just do them when I think of them so just keep your eyes peeled and have a good day bye